Hundreds of people had a front row seat to this historical moment, including Governor Ralph Northam, who announced his intention to take the monument down last summer. Our Cameron Thompson joins us now with more on what the governor and other witnesses are saying about today. Cameron. Yeah, and Bill, Candace, Governor Northam being in the majority of those who are out there today cheering on the removal of this statue, saying it was long overdue, but at the same time admitting there is more work that needs to be done. And just, this was a, a good day for Virginia. Those words from Governor Ralph Northam Wednesday after crews removed the Robert E. Lee statue from Monument Avenue. A statue that, that glorified uh, really a traitor. Over a year after he ordered it be done, only for legal battles to hold it up. And it's a symbol for Virginia that, uh, that we're uh, open here, we're inclusive, and that, that our lights are on and our doors are open, and, and we really welcome people to Virginia. Northam was joined by other state and local leaders for the removal, along with hundreds of others outside the security fencing, both for and against what was happening. And now today to see it gone is like, wow, finally, because we were doubtful there for a while. When you try to eradicate it, remove it, destroy it, or disrespect it, you're going down a wrong road. Others adding the removal was entirely symbolic and more systemic issues like housing, police and education reform still need to be addressed. But we have a present and we have a future and we have to focus on those two things because there are people depending on us and depending on this energy. Meanwhile, with Lee gone, Monument Avenue is now free from Confederate statues. What will become of the pedestals and ground on which they once stood is still undecided, but there's no shortage of ideas. Let this area return to a community space. I hope they continue tending to the crops and the plants that were planted right here. I hope the fence goes down. Maybe use it to uh, put up statues for people from Richmond that have done great things. Now regarding the reimagining of Monument Avenue, Governor Northam says they will be listening to Virginians and working with the Virginia Museum of Fine, Art, Fine Arts to figure out what to do, but says in the end he wants it to become a welcoming place so that when people come down the street, they see what Virginia is really all about.